Hey, what's up, YouTube? Welcome to a new video. My name is Prince Mason. Today's video, we're going to talk about five places you can get cheap gear. So if you have gas, like me, you can always get your gear for cheap. So let's talk about five places you can get cheap gear. But before we get into that, make sure you check out my digital store where I have some amazing products digital products to help you retouch better, retouch faster. So check it out, I have my retouching essentials pack, my creative color lots for color grading outdoor images, they are amazing. Also check out my skin tone lots for dark skin and light skin tone. And you can download the raw images that I have on there, use it to practice and send to me on Instagram. And I'll tell you if you did great or not. If I not reply you, then you probably not do great. I'm just, just messing around, just, just messing around. Yeah, I also have my free frequency impression action there, so go download that. Check out my digital store, I'll put a link in the description below. And also, if you want to sign up for the waitlist for my retouching masterclass, I'll put a link in the description below. Hit that link and go sign up on the waitlist. So whenever the class is available, I'll send you an email and you'll be one of the first people to know. So do that. Now let's talk about five places that you can get affordable gear and five places that I've bought gear from and I can, 100% recommend them to you. No, I can't. Now, with everything you do on the internet, you have to be careful, you have to look up reviews, you have to check for the people that you are buying from and make sure that gear is in immaculate condition. Now, some of these places, they sell new gear and some they sell used gear. So make sure you do your own research on these places before you send your money to anybody to buy gear. Prince Mason is not going to be responsible when you lose money. Put that at the back of your mind. This is not advice, just my opinion. Thank you. Anyways, the first place I recommend is Fred Miranda. Now, I have bought gear from Fred Miranda and it is an amazing photography um, forum where people come to talk about photography and at the same time photographers sell their new or used gear um, from, from cameras to lenses to laptops to phones. You can buy almost anything on Fred Miranda and you can also sell on Fred Miranda so you can go there and list now. Put that back in mind that people will not sell stuff to you if you do not have reviews. So if you are new there, you have to wait, be patient, and eventually you might find somebody that is going to sell to you. It took a while before I found someone that was going to sell to me. And right now I think I have about 10 reviews on there. So I'm good. So if people give you good reviews, then people will sell to you. But if you get one bad review from the beginning, then you're doomed. So just make sure that you um, actually deal with people sincerely don't go there trying to cheat anybody. You know, if you want to buy gear, make sure you pay through PayPal so that you have your customer protection thing, you know, and, and just be very careful when you're buying gear from anywhere, honestly. But I bought from Fred Miranda, I bought from a few photographers, I've never had issues with anything I bought from them. I've been shopping on Fred Miranda since 2014 or 2015, and it's somewhere I always check or somewhere I check first when I'm looking to buy used gear. So put that at the back of your mind. That's the first place. Now, the second one is KH. KH is like Fred Miranda where you can buy used gear, but this time it's run by a company and they have warranties and all that stuff. So if you're not comfortable with buying from Fred Miranda, then definitely check out KH. It might just be a little bit expensive or more expensive than Fred Miranda, but put it at the back of your mind that these people will offer you a warranty. So if your mind is safer at KH, then definitely buy from KH. So that's number two, K-E-H. So number three is eBay. Oh my God. Be careful when you're buying on eBay, but you can get some amazing deals on eBay. You can buy some amazing gear for cheap on eBay. So make sure you check out eBay. But just make sure you're careful when you're buying from eBay because, I mean, eBay has crazy stories. I bought from eBay. The last thing I bought from eBay was my bike and I had it delivered to a friend in the UK before they sent it down. So yes, there are a lot of reputable people on eBay. Just make sure you do your research, um, read reviews about the person, the seller you're buying from, check out their star rating or whichever way they do it on eBay. Just make sure you do your research. That's one thing that I'm preaching constantly in this video. Do your research before you send your money to anybody. But there are some amazing deals on eBay. There are some people that just want to sell off their gear. There are some photographers that have bought gear for a while and they're not using it and they'll just sell it up at a, um, sell it off at a cheaper price. There are people that are in debt and they need to sell their stuff off to pay their debt. There's some people that just really need money like right now, like me, I really need money, but I'm not selling any of my gear. But you guys get, so there are people that just sell their stuff um, and you might just stumble on that deal. So definitely check out eBay. Now, number four is Amazon. Now, there are always deals on Amazon. So you should definitely check it out. Sometimes gears go for cheap. Sometimes you can get used gear. Just be careful when you're doing that from Amazon. And I mean, it's Amazon. What can I say? I don't have to talk too much about Amazon. I'm pretty sure everybody has bought something from Amazon. And if you haven't, then check them out. 
and you might get some good deals there then number five and six or just number five is Adroma and B and H. Now, if you are looking for somewhere to buy with all the confidence in the world, definitely check out Adroma and B and H. I don't think people ever have issues from buying from these people. They are a reputable company. They've been there for years, and sometimes they have amazing deals on gear that you can check out and buy. Just make sure you check them regularly and make sure you sign up for their mailing list, and you can get deals and deals and refurbished cameras and all that kind of stuff. And yeah, so definitely check out Adorama and BNH. I don't really have to talk too much about them. Looking for reputable people to buy from? Adorama BNH. Now, the last and not the least that I'll mention, this is just the bonus point, is check out your manufacturer's website. So if you're a Sony shooter or you're a Canon shooter or any of these companies, all you have to do is go check their sites and check the site where they sell refurbished products and you'll be surprised and amazed at how cheap these cameras and lenses go for. But I mean, they just come out once in a while and before you know it, people have bought everything out. So you have to be smart, you have to be sharp. So check out those websites. Anyways, thank you for watching today's video. If you want to support this channel, check out my digital store and you can always buy something from me and it would help you retouch better, help you retouch faster at the same time. It'll help me make more videos, make out time to make more YouTube videos like this for you guys. So I hope you guys have learned something, a thing or two from this video. Anyways, thank you for watching today's video. Give me a thumbs up. If you know any other place you buy photography gear for cheap, let me know. Put it in the comments below and let other people see it. I mean, we're all here to teach, help other people grow. So thanks so much for watching today's video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Have an amazing day. My name is Prince Mason. Peace out.